Tonight, staff at a New Jersey hospital demanding better security after a stabbing in the parking lot that landed a veteran nurse in intensive care. That vicious attack happened last night as the victim was leaving work at Newark University Hospital. Eyewitness News reporter Lucy Yang with more on what the union wants to see done to prevent another incident. 7.30 Sunday night, a longtime nurse at Newark University Hospital was walking to her car in the parking lot when she was rushed right back into the emergency room. We're told a man stabbed her in the abdomen during a violent robbery. Colleagues tonight concerned for the nurse's recovery. She's a good woman. She didn't deserve this. The nurse's union says the victim in her 60s is now in intensive care. She has been with the hospital for 25 years, a quarter of a century bringing joy to families in the labor and delivery ward. Her union now pressing the hospital for more security, especially when it gets dark so early. It's an open parking lot, and that's the concern, open parking lot. So we would like to have more security in, involved, patrolling, being, if, being to come out, watch while we come out. Indeed, you can see how there are open access points from the street. Rutgers police or whatever, to have somebody stationed out here around a time when we leave at dark. You know, a lot of administration leave about 4 o'clock, 5 o'clock. But after that, then what about the rest of us? The union tells us they will be meeting with administrators on Tuesday to discuss safety concerns. We understand that meeting was scheduled even before the attack. But of course, those security concerns are all the more urgent now.